Hi everyone, Dennis Foley from Acoustic Fields. Today we're going to talk about our platforms, platform power. So we know that usually the ceiling dimension in rooms is the shortest distance, right? Width, height, length. Ceiling always, I think, without exception. In a few cases it's not, but most of the time it is. Uh, or the next dimension after that is width. It's a little bit sh uh, shorter, but anyway. The height and the width have to work together. So lower numbers in dimensions produce higher modal issues, higher lower frequency and higher amplitude issues. It's the amplitude or strength of the frequency that bothers us. That's what creates the modes. And we know that those exaggerate and attenuate constantly. So the last thing you want when you're trying to get resolution in a particular room. Our eight, nine, 10, 11 foot ceiling heights Produce 55 to 80 cycle problems, floor to ceiling. Remember, we got three sound fields. So this is the frequency range that those heights create problems. And they can just, I had one the other day at 65. It just couldn't hear anything for 65 to 80. And it was a mix engineer, so it was real critical. So we had to help him with that. Low frequency amplitudes at, require at least you treat the ceiling or the floor or sometimes both, depending on how much energy you're going to squeeze between those surfaces. EDM guys are way different. <laughs> we have to do everything with those guys because they operate at very, very high pressure levels, very, very low frequency. So that's and very, very small rooms. So it's a recipe for disaster across the board. So we gotta treat at least one of the surface areas, right? Either the floor or ceiling, sometimes both. Now, to get to that 55 to 65 cycle range, right in the middle, so to speak, here, we gotta use carbon. You know, foam won't do it, perforated absorption won't do it. That's our other technology, been around for years. Won't do it. So we gotta use our carbon to get that. Well, carbon's heavy. We can't be suspended from the ceilings. People do it sometimes, but we don't suggest it because units are 175 pounds each, and one of those falls on you, you're dead. So you want to be very, very careful. But So the platform is our way of treating that 55 to 65 cycle problem on the floor. Then it can't fall on you. You can sit on it for a digital audio workstation. You can sit in it with your chair for a two-channel a hi-fi listening position because it works on pressure. And the best place to locate pressure reacting treatments is close to the source or the receiver as you can. So if you're sitting on it, that's pretty close. That's why small home theaters are great with risers. So we can put the low frequency absorption in the riser because you got usually 10 inches. You know, we need 10 inches, 8 to 10 to 12 inches of depth. So you don't usually get that in a riser put our carbon technology inside the riser, you have a diaphragmatic absorber. So that works out really good. So piano platform really is the ceiling, right? If you think about it, so if you have the piano and there's the floor, this is 36 inches. So that's really the ceiling. So you got a really small space there. So you have to be really careful. So we're gonna treat it by putting it on a platform. That'll absorb that excess energy. Drum platform works, this, or the DAW platform works the same way. Drum platform works the same way. Sub platforms work the same way. You can add drum in here too. So they all work the same way because we're all trying to treat that floor to ceiling dimension. That's the issue. Ceiling CPA starts at 65 hertz. That's our perforated absorber. So carbon from 55 to 65, 65 to a couple hundred for the perforated absorber, then the foam comes in at 125. So it's ACDA, carbon panel, CPA, and foam. Those are our three tools that we use to deal with all of these frequency range. So platforms have a lot of power and they can really help you with your problems without going to the ceiling. Now, we can, we've got pressure and reflection problems, so we usually still have to treat the ceiling for reflections, but that can you know be just four inches of treatment. And it's lightweight because that would be foam. Platform power. Hope this helps. Thank you.
Thank you for watching this video, and if you liked it, please give us a thumbs up. We also have a newsletter that you can subscribe to, so please do that because we offer special price discounts to only those on our newsletter. And then don't forget about our forum. We have started a forum on our own website where people ask questions and I usually get a chance every couple days to look at it. There's an interchange between people on the forum and we'll give you real answers uh, on a regular basis, so that'll help you. Thank you.